So some exciting updates on my Sling TSI build. I had the engine and firewall forward kits delivered yesterday, and I had the canopy kit uh, and some backordered parts delivered last week. So a little more than a week ago, I had the canopy kit delivered and uh, I had ordered this uh, at the same time I ordered all of the, the base kits back in March of 2021. Uh, this one was delayed for some reason. So uh, got it delivered. Unfortunately, you see the hole in the side of it uh, from a forklift, I guess. I opened it up, got into it. Everything was fine. There were no scratches. Um, nothing was broken. And then yesterday I got the engine and the firewall forward kit. Uh, which is very exciting. It's very cool to see the engine. Uh, I had ordered uh, the engine and the firewall forward kit back in January, I believe. Uh, so it took about seven and a half, eight months to get here. Uh, so I, I sort of just basically just pulled the cover off the front so I could take some pictures and look it over and pet my new engine. 915 IS Rotax. Um, so it was kind of fun to see and have it here uh, with all the shipping delays and all. It was kind of nice to have it on hand, although I won't need it for quite some time. There were some stickers on the, uh, the ECU box that said uh, February of 2022. So uh, at least that portion of it, I guess, was manufactured then. Um, the firewall forward kit also came in with the engine. Uh, it has quite a bit of stuff in there and it, it also they had laid in some back-ordered parts that uh, I was still lacking I, I continue to get shipments of back-ordered parts about every two or three weeks and uh, and then there were some more that were in this firewall forward kit it's a quite a range of miscellaneous uh, parts um, I haven't gone through and done an inventory yet, but this is just some pictures. This is the uh, backordered parts that I had that they stuck in there. So it was a, a few things that I was lacking. I'm going to have to get into the, those inventories as well. So I'm still not really building yet, but I've got some projects around the hangar that I'm going to be working on. I'll probably do some videos. This is the uh, asphalt in front of my hangar. I'm going to reseal, fill in the cracks, um, get that done. And then as you can see, my hangar is in terrible shape. Uh, I've got a couple projects where I'm going to uh, recover all of the insulation and kind of patch it up and clean everything, and I've got to lube everything. Anyway, um, like and subscribe, and uh, you'll see those videos coming out, and more build videos are coming. Thanks for watching.